Hey guys, decaf 13 here, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Devil Survivor Overclocked. In the last episode, we fought Belial and made our way to the end of the sixth day. And now we are faced with a decision. Who do we want to go with for our seventh day? Of course, I've known the answer to this question from the start of this Let's Play. But during this Let's Play, we've had various choices to make on what we would do at what time. I'm sure you've heard me talking about... Uh, scheduled events. That was me following a perfect guide, uh, so I get every ending on the first try, as well as unlockable characters, too. But we'll see the results of that in a while. Uh, but in the last episode, as I mentioned, we have six... well, really five paths to go down. We can go with Naoya, Amane, Kaido, uh, Jin, Yuzu, or Atsuro. And of course, like I said, I've made my decision. And I want to be the king. You find Naoya and Kaido talking. They seem to be discussing some kind of plan. Yo, you guys. Hey, Kaido. You've come. I found someone with interesting talents, so I invited him. It seems that you already know each other. Huh. <laughs> This smart guy's your cousin, right? I thought so. You're both weird. Thanks. Have you made your decision to assume the throne of Bell? If you become Overlord, the lockdown will be lifted and mankind will be saved. But the angels who ordered the lockdown and their own leader won't be happy. You mean God. That's right. It's God. The one who rules this world and master of the angels who force these ordeals on us. If you try to use the powers of demons to take control, they will surely intervene. Unless God's hold on the world is broken, your wishes will never come true. Being released from God, huh? Well, bring it on! Hey, what about your plan? You mean the comp facility that the Shomonkai have? My crew's already taken hold of it. If I join this plan, we won't need to use those comps. But, as long as we control the plant, we won't have to worry about any new demon tamers. Sounds good. That'll let us focus on our own plan. This lockdown only happened because God's selfish. He's sitting back in heaven while he orders the government to do whatever he wants. All this was starting to piss me off. I want to meet this God guy face to face and beat his punk ass down. I love that quote from Kaido. I want to meet this God guy face to face and beat his punk ass down. <laughs> it won't end with the death of God. Once he is overlord, this world is his. Everything you want will be yours. Money, food, whatever you wish for. Then again, money will be useless at that point. <laughs> now, tell me your decision. Have you made up your mind to become king? <laughs> I want to be the king. <laughs> Good. There's my cousin. Hey, you're not serious about this, are you? I'm very serious. <sighs> Sorry, I can't go with you. Huh? Yoohoo, what are you saying? We can't do this. All this talk about killing God and crushing the SDF people? But we don't have a choice. If we don't, they're going to kill us anyway. I'm sorry. Thanks for everything. Goodbye. Yuzu, hey! Yuzu leaves. Damn it. What's she gonna do on her own? I'm sorry. I... Uh, I can't go along with this either. What? Midori leaves as well. M midori you too? Sorry, but I can't do this. There's no way I can agree with what you're trying to do. Keisuke leaves. Wh what's with everyone? Keisuke too? Leave them be. Anyone in this world can be replaced easily. You choose your own friends. Don't waste time and energy fighting with them. Well, if that's that, let's do our best from now on. Kaido joined the party. Pazuzu can now be fused using the Cathedral of Shadows. What are you trying to do, Naoya? What do you gain if he's an overlord? Aren't you happy for him? I'm giving my cousin the gift of power, even over demons. <laughs> I'm happy. Huh, I see. In any case, mankind stands to gain something from this. If a man rules demonkind, the demons will not harm humans. Indeed, demons will serve man. 
If that doesn't satisfy you, then go and get rid of all the demons in the world. Being an overlord isn't as bad as it would seem at first glance, don't you think? Well, well maybe, but... Say, is this really going to stop that final option thing the government's plotting? It depends on the negotiation, but what fool would say no to a loyal army of demons? The government may be foolish, but even they should realize what refusal would mean. Huh. <laughs> Got a point. Now, is there anything else you want to ask me about? Uh, nothing really. Um, we're really going to be okay, right? We only have until 1800 tomorrow. You're a worrier, aren't you? Relax. Every step has already been calculated. I have some matters to look into. I'll be back by morning. Get some rest. The final touches are set. The last curtain will rise, and you will be King of Bell. Hey, who is that guy, seriously? He programmed the comp. Right, so he may be the person who knows the most about this lockdown. The person, huh? <laughs> well, whoever he is, he freaks the hell out of me. His mind's way too sharp. He's got a lot of secrets, doesn't he? Huh. Everybody says that when they meet him for the first time. Uh, well, what he says makes sense. I don't think he's lying to us either. I don't see a problem in teaming up with him, for now. Well, in any case, I'm partying with the next demon lord, huh? <laughs> awesome. So, what are you gonna do when you become the overlord? <laughs> Whatever I want. Nice. Oh, you totally look like a villain just now. They're all gonna pay. Hold on, guys. I'm gonna be right back. Alright, sorry about that. Just had to go get something real quick. Locking us in here with the demons. Government bastards and the angels behind them. The lockdown. We'd be enjoying normal life if we weren't stuck in here. Well, that's enough talking. It's time to rest up. We're gonna have lots of fun tomorrow. Yeah, we are. All right, so let's save over this. Last day, King of Demons. Oh, morning. Hey, how do you think you who's doing? I wonder if she got any sleep last night. Hey, don't worry about it. Yeah, well, no use moping about it. Let's focus on what we gotta do. Yo, Mr. Overlord. Looks like you're up. <laughs> <laughs> know your place, worm. Ha ha ha, pretty funny there. I thought you were a serious type. You're getting into it, huh? <laughs> hey, looks like your cousin's here. Sorry to keep you all waiting. Hey, now yeah. You finished your research yet? We're all set to go, man. Indeed I have. And it'll prove useful before long. But there is one bit of bad news. Bad news? What is it? It's not a big deal, but the government's final option is now scheduled for noon today. Uh, hey, that is a big deal. Yeah, what are we gonna do? We only have a few hours! Stop panicking over every little thing. It can be easily compensated for. Oh, okay. I mean, I have no choice but to trust you anyway. Um, but I wanted to make sure of something one last time. Yes? Um... If he becomes king, will everyone really be saved? Who knows? Ask him. He's the one who'll be saving everyone. Yeah, why not? <laughs> you see, Atsuro, the king will work things out and save everyone. Now, if there are no further questions, let's get started. We're gonna take out those bell guys first, right? <laughs> yes, we are. Let's see if this piques your interest. Our first opponent lurks within a human. Ah, uh, I see. That's interesting. <laughs> we'll be doing battle against a demon within a human mind. A rare experience. Our target is Jezebel, who's currently in residence inside Amane's consciousness. Hey, Jezebel's inside Amane, right? How in the world do we beat a demon like that? We, uh, we'll go in with it. With it? Wait, you mean inside Amane? <laughs> like that's even possible. Um, could I bother you for a second? Oh, hey, Mari. 
Miss Mari, you didn't hear what we were saying, did you? Is Tadashi here? Tadashi? Who's... Whoa! Mari? What'd you come here for? I thought it over. What? I'll go with you. What the... Are you stupid or something? We're... I know. You know? Then why are you... I had to get revenge for the man I loved. My life was on hold until I did. I knew it would be dangerous. I knew I was being selfish. But I had to see it through. Mari... You helped me. Even then. You let me lean on you. That's why, this time, it's my turn to let you lean on me. Whatever you do, you're still the same Tadashi. I'm going with you. S suit yourself. I'll leave it up to you to decide. May I please come with you? We'd be glad to have you. Thank you. Don't worry, I brought a comp. I can hold my own. Mari joins your party. Wait, oh, I'm he coming too. Huh? You're... You're that demon from before! I keep hold my promises. Risking my life for friends in a freeze is the way of a samurai, ho! Let's do our best, ho. Ha! <laughs> well, if we're out to become Overlord, having a demon with us shouldn't be a problem. Alright, ho. I'm gonna show my he-manliness. Overlord's magical punishment, ho! Black Frost joins your party. Hey. That guy's kind of shady looking. Is this okay? <laughs> it's fine. Don't worry about it, Kaido. But anyway, yeah, welcome to the seventh day. Uh, <laughs> I really like this path. Especially because we get some of the best characters in the game. Like Kaido, who's the best physical attacker in the game. Look at that attack and vi- look at that strength and vitality. Sure, he's a bit slower than Atsuro. But he's still probably... No, he is still hands down the best physical attacker in the game. He's got good vitality, good strength. Amazing. Now he, uh, he's pretty well-rounded. He's more, more so a mage. He kind of has the same build that I do. Like, decent strength. Built more into magic. Has vitality and agility, too. Let's see. Then we have Mari here, who just specializes really in magic vitality, making her an amazing spellcaster. And we have Black Frost, who, although he has three movements, there is a redeeming feature for him. He has innate resistances. He naturally reflects fire and ice. The only downside is that he's weak to force. So if you're going to use him, make sure you give him a, a like null force, resist force or something. Just cancel out that weakness. But even then, you have a pretty solid teammate here. Uh, I really don't know. Well, I'm gonna swap. I'm gonna swap out at Soro, definitely, because we've been using him for this whole LP, and I want to give some other people a chance. So let's start with Kaido. Let's give you Deathbound. We'll give you. Where's Power Hit? There it is. Power Hit, and we'll also give you Mighty Hit. We'll give you Life Surge. Pierce. What else did that Sura have on him? Oh, he had Life Aid. You know what? I'm gonna give you Ares Aid. Increase that crit rate of yours. And we'll give you Marksman. Mari, let's see. I'll give you Medaya. You have Ice Dance. And I'll give you Akidine. I'll give you Mana Bonus. You can have... You have Ice Amp. And I'll give you Null Physical. And let's give you Fortify to further increase your defenses. Now, yeah. I need some more memory to. Let's see, Amrita. Force Dance. 
shield all. Oh, I should have given him a mana bonus. Oh well. Let's see, I'll give you Force Amp. You can have a Lack Repel. And you can have Null Curse. Actually, you know what? No, I, I want to put Null Curse back on myself. You can have Anti Curse. And I'll give you Blitzkrieg. So let's fix this mess. Alright, I hit Medaya. Uh, Dirahan. Mana Surge. And give me that Null Curse. Alright. Here's our team going into the final day, and... Whew, I, I think it's looking pretty good. Let's see what we can do with the auction. We can get Culebres. Yeah, let's get one. Let's... right off the bat, 5900 now. 6300, 6700, 7000, 7200. Let's see, can we fuse away Ervada? Could lock. Let's fucking do it. Power hit, brutal hit, Fufudine. Uh, let's see. Life Surge. And Null Force. <laughs> Hell, that's pretty good. We'll see about that, Kutlock. Alright. <laughs> oh, man. I'm really gonna need to start grinding to improve my demons. Actually, you know what? Since we have them off on the sidelines, I'm gonna like, clear you guys out. I'm gonna give you Watchful. I'm gonna give you Vigilant, just so you guys can gain some more EXP. Just because of no, I'm not going to use it on anyone else. Here, I have Null Force Frosty. That's so good. Two Reflects and a Null. Let's save over this again. Alright, uh... Actually, let's check out Free Battles. I want to see if there's anything I can crack real quick. If there is, I'm just going to cut out... Oh, there it is. Diyama. Fi oh, Fizz Repel. Yes. Alright, see, so yeah, I'm gonna be right back, guys. Alright, you know what? Let's just try going for the Amane battle. Maybe we'll do it. Uh, um, now you. How did Jezebel get inside Amane anyway? Ah. Belbareth, the raging god that the Shomonkai worships, planted it inside her. Jezebel's one of his faithful servants, you see. So he used Amane's innate abilities to bring Jezebel into the human world. So how do we fight it? <laughs> it's quite simple. We just need to go into Amane's mind. That's simple? Huh? Are you that surprised? If we attacked Amane directly and Jezebel managed to escape, she'd go back to her master Belbareth and transfer her bell power over to him, which would put us more at a disadvantage. Hmm, he's got a point. All right, I get it. And what's the plan, Stan? <laughs> By capturing Amane and hooking her mind up to a comp, we can strike directly at Jezebel. Hmm, so... Well, hook her mind up to a comp. The demon summoning program runs off of human thoughts siphoned from the internet. So, we just feed the program the thoughts of the comp's user. In other words, us. Comps already have a function to relay the user's thoughts of command to the server. Naoya, you designed the comp to be able to do this stuff from the start? Just how far are you able to foresee into the future? Pretty far. Now why would I answer that? <laughs> Come on, let's go capture Amane. Show no mercy to anyone who gets in our way. Hmm? Who are you? You're your I've come to borrow your maiden, so step aside, weaklings. What? Stay away from Lady Amane! 
You have come, Naya. Or shall I call you Cain, child of God? Well, well. Your plot is unmasked. You seek the power of Jezebel. Well, well. What have we here? An angel appears before us. I am the angel, Remiel. By order of the Lord, I have come to rend your standard in twain. Prepare yourself. <laughs> you accursed angels. In that body, you can't even use your full power. Think you can win against me? Hey, take care of the personal business later. Let's hurry up and snag the maiden. Hmm. I know. Remiel, we can fight later. Right now, we need that girl. Looks like things could get rough. She's not gonna be easy to grab like this. It won't be an issue. Destroy anyone who opposes us. We can't have the maiden resisting either. Knock her out. Huh. Got it. In other words, I don't have to hold back at all. Yep. Alright, defeat all adversaries. What do we got to crack? Megiddo, Mediraha. Oh, there's so much good stuff. Y Magic Yin. Even though she also has Megiddo. Oh, actually. Oh, we can get Megiddo from that Tautier. Damn, you're the only one with Mediraha. At least other people have Samaricarm. Hmm. Be careful not to get too close to Amane. That's the thing. All these people have to have fucking ranged attacks. Fucking bullshit. Amane is the only one who doesn't. I also have mana aid though. It's like what I want to go for. Ooh, strengthen. That's not bad. Yeah, I'll just go for magic again. Kaido. Yeah, you can go for strengthen. Now yeah, you go from Guido. And Mari Samara Yeah, Mari can go for Samara Karm. This seems like it's gonna be a tricky battle to do. I'm not cracking anything from you guys, so that's fine. Kaido, you go there. Mari. Oh, damn it, ice is totally useless. I just have Mari built with ice. You know what, let's change that up then. You don't have strength to be... Oh, you've banned fire though, so what's the fucking point? Uh... You know, let's switch cracks then. You go for Megiddo. And now you can go for Samaricarm. Alright, let's see how badly this goes. I can tell I'm gonna get fucking destroyed. Oh, 
Oh cool, we're still on the Calabre. Hey, you know what, that, that actually wasn't too bad. Oh, you even... Uh, now you can do this. Go now, yeah. <laughs> you know what? Instead of Amrita, I'll give you some air karma. Uh, so strong. Oh yeah, something I didn't mention that I actually wanted to talk about for this battle. Uh, if you didn't do all of Jin's stuff, like if you didn't uh, tell him about Azuma, well, Azuma, and uh, like help him out during that battle, Jin would be here. Like if you didn't even trigger the Jin Azuma battle. Jin will be here with Azuma and Amane. So, yeah, it's pretty tricky. Oh shit. Now, hand over the power of Jezebel. Was this your aim, Cain? Child of God? The Lord is saddened. Oh no. Magic. Especially with Magic Yin, that's not good. Fuck. Uh, shield all. Zeodyne. I don't fucking know. Rook, you're, you're useless here. Damn it. You shielded all to him, son of a bitch. Oh my god, that is so much. Oh, Megiddo, now he's fucked. Jeez. Nope. Not even. Okay, they aren't even moving, thankfully. Oh, he's moving away. Alright, here we go. Uh, mag up. I'm disappointed. I wanted to see you lead people as God's child. But, if you desire the throne of Bell, I will prune you while you are a seedling. I can't stand you, Ramiel. I've pretty much just made all her mana costs good. Uh, fuck me. Uh, power hit. Ah, whatever. Let's both get our shields up. Shit. Okay, good, you gave me an extra turn. Oh, fuck that. No, Odin! No! Oh, I am so fucking done. Oh my god, Kresnik. Oh my god. I'm so fucking dead. Yeah, I'm fucking dead, because this fucking dickhole. Fuck you. Yo, fuck you. You know? Fuck you. Whoa! Hey! You know, maybe... Don't even! Oh, you fucks have Samaricarm, too. Now he's gone, too. Well, there goes my Samaricarm. I'm so fucking done. Damn. I don't have anyone else who can revive, do I? Son of a bitch. Yeah, I have no one else who can use revive. Fuck. Alright, oh, you've strengthened, so that doesn't fucking matter.
so dizzy. Fucking stop. Fuck, am I still alive? Like, ha how? I'm on. Mar Mario's fucking done. Oh boy. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna restart. I I have some training to do. So as anticlimactic as it is, I'm going to actually end the episode here. So in the next one we'll be back to redo the Amane fight. I'll see you guys then. Bye.